guys, welcome back to Merlin's Law. Today I would like to share with you some tips and tricks how to learn Dutch language in my way. I know everyone learns a different way, so it's totally up to you. If you find this way is useful for you, feel free to implement it. And the reason why I would like to share with you, not just because I live in the Netherlands, but I also love foreign languages and one of them is Dutch. So how do I learn Dutch? Every day I would like to implement one new thing in my head, at least a new word or a new grammatical formula or maybe repeating the previous things that I have learned in the past. Today we are going to learn about conjunction. Conjunction in Dutch means voegwoorden. Voeg means to add, to voegen, to add. Worden is just words. So meaning we have words to be added in a sentence. And today we are going to learn about because, because is one of the conjunctions we use it almost every day in every sentence. Want verbind hofzin and hofzin. Hofzin is a main clause and bijzin is a subordinate clause. Omdat verbind hofzin and bijzin. Now we have a question. Waarom eet jij? Ik eet bla bla bla, ik heb honger. Ik eet want ik heb honger. I eat because I'm hungry. Ik drink, ik heb dorst. Ik drink, want ik heb dorst. I drink because I'm thirsty. When you use omdat, the structure will be different. Ik eet omdat ik honger heb. Ik as a subject, honger as a zinstillen and heb as a vervoegde werkwoord. And this verb should be at the end of the sentence. Nu probeer de zinnen af te maken. Gebruik want en omdat. Ik ga naar de dokter omdat. Ik moet boodschappen halen omdat. Hij gaat met de bus want. Alright, so you have just learned about the usage of want and omdat in different occasions. Try to implement this on daily basis in every sentences that you are about to make. Let's say, ja, ik ga eten, want ik heb honger. Ik ga naar buiten, want ik verveel me thuis. Of using omdat almost all the time, because omdat is somehow tricky, because you have to place the verb to the end of the sentence. Try to use omdat one week straight, and you will see what's the result later on. Okay, I hope this is useful for you. Let me know in the comment below if you think this is useful or not or you would like to see more videos like this. And thank you so much for watching this video and see you in another time. Bye!